What's up everybody? Just wanted to show you really quick something I'm working on. I've been trying to do a lot of 3D uh, building in Anime Studio or Moho 12 and I thought I'd try and build a Minecraft character just because it's made of simple shapes and seems pretty easy to do. So I recreated this character today and you can see here if I use the uh, or rotate XY layer uh, my whole character is in a folder and I can rotate him uh, 360 degrees I can actually turn the character to have a bird's eye view from up above or I can do um, from below so it's actually it's a true 3d character and let me show you something else real quick so all of the parts the arms legs torso and head are all in different uh, folders so if I grab those and use the rotate XY, I actually can um, pose my character pretty easy in 3D space and put the arms in any position I want um, just by clicking on them and rotating them. I can uh, change the feet really easy. And I think the coolest one is the head. If I click on the head group and use the rotate XY, it actually will just follow my cursor wherever I point it to. So it's really easy to animate. I can go in the timeline Oops, I have an animation in here already. But I can go in and create a pose really fast by just grabbing the layers and rotating um, these layers really fast. So that's what I'm working on. I think I'll make a tutorial uh, if you guys want one. Uh, just let me know in the comments below. And also I'm trying to uh, add styles. Oh, I'm not trying, I did. <laughs> If I go to skin color, I can actually change the skin tone. And I have two separate skin styles, or skin color styles. So if like I do, let's say we made this kind of a zombie character, I turn that into green, I'll go to skin color, and I'll go to skin color two, and then I'll use the eyedropper to just grab that color and then double click on the fill and make it a little darker just so it uh, turns into a kind of shaded color of that skin. Same thing with the shirt, if I select shirt, go in here and select a color, I can select orange and then I'll select shirt color two, drag that, pick it and then make it a little darker, and same thing with the pants too. So, you know, purple, pants color two, grab that same color and then just shade it a little bit. So hopefully uh, this character is going to be, I think it's going to be work pretty well. I just need to make switch layers to um, control the mouths, create some new mouths and new eyes. I think I'll completely redo the face just to make it more expressive, kind of like the uh, Minecraft story game, I believe it is. I, I actually haven't played it, but um, just more expressive faces. And then I, I'll see if I can't make some switch group layers for the arms and stuff to make it more easy to pose. But this this seems to work pretty good. So uh, if you have any questions or comments, just leave them down below. And like I said, I'll be making um, a tutorial for this soon. And for all my patrons, I'll go ahead and send you this file uh, when it's all done um, so you can check it out and mess around with it and play with it. But uh, that's it. Thanks for watching.